Hi, welcome back. In this video, we're going to explore the media browser. All right, without further ado, let's get started. So we are inside of Adobe Premiere Pro and I'm currently using all panels workspace. All right, so to find the media browser, uh, you can find it here on the left side. So if you cannot find it here, just uh, click on this icon, look for media browser. All right, click on that. Now I'm currently on the media browser. As you can see, it's a little bit smaller here. So you can just simply drag this media browser wherever you want, all right? So in my case, I'm gonna drag it here on the next two program sequence, all right? So that you have a, a better uh, look. So if I'm on the stage of organizing my, um, my footage in the media browser, I can do this, okay? So basically, Media Browser will allow you to access your Macintosh HD or your hard drive in your computer without going outside of the application, which is Adobe Premiere Pro. So you can just simply go to Media Browser, click on uh, Media Browser here, all right? But if you can't find it really, so go to Window at the top and then look for uh, Media Browser, all right? Make sure you have Check on it or Shift 8 for the shortcut. Cool. Now the media browser is right here. So we go to local drives, Macintosh HD, we'll go to users folder, uh, and then uh, users files, and I'll go to the desktop, lessons file here, and I can search for our assets. Basically, where's, uh, where's your file located, all right? And then here we have video here, all right? Now you can see all of the footage here, all right? Now, if you want to do this list view, you can click on this. If you want to do the thumbnail view, you can click on that. All right, so this is gonna be your th thumbnail view and it also works like hovering your mouse here. You can preview your footage without going outside of Premiere Pro, all right? So take note that we are not actually um, importing anything in Premiere Pro, but we can still see everything in our computer, all right, by using Media Browser, okay? We can browse our media using this uh, panel, all right? So there's a quick, uh, there's a tools here that we can, uh, that we can explore. So here is you can search for any media browser or you can search for any files that you're looking for. All right. Say, for example, I'm looking for the false clip that uh, I have in this folder and they can just type in here. You will see this clip and then you can basically double click it. All right. And they will automatically import to your source monitor. I just double click it and then you can just, um, directly edit it uh, right away all right you can set in points there you can set out points here and then you can just simply drag and drop this uh video clip directly in your timeline all right let's delete this picture all right all right now all right if you go here all right the video is already here in our timeline all right simple as that all right so all right so it's already in here in our timeline all right, so if you go back to media browser again, all right, that's a cool way that you can edit it directly and put it back and put it to your uh, timeline automatically. All right, uh, timeline immediately. All right, so the next one is this. All right, so we have here directory viewers. So if you click on this, you can uh, you can filter or you can just view just one specific files if you have if you work on with multiple files of uh, of media if you have av avc hd cinema dng dpx red sony hdv or xd cam x you can just simply click in this directory viewers and you can just simply click on that if you have those kind of formats that was shot on your um computer all right so you can just simply uh, filter those uh, kind of format so right now i don't have any uh, other um, format that's why it's only a file directory all right and also you can use this to file types of display all right so say for example you have some kind of these files mp3 audio uh, json or jpeg gif file just click on that and it will filter all of those uh, formats for you all right so let's say we have png file all right no png file and let's look for um, MP4. All right, MPEG movie. All right, and now you will see all of the. Uh, it will filter your um, your uh, results here. All right. So we have here the settings. Open and just settings, where you can see general, scratch this, and in just settings, and the project of your uh, Premiere Pro project. All right. So click on OK and that. You can also open your project files here. There's a cool way. All right. So you can also open your project file. Um, Adobe project file in Premiere Pro using um, media browser. All right. 
All right, so that's how you use Media Browser inside Premiere Pro to organize or import your uh, footage files in your from your computer. All right, so thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video.